Hey everybody, I'm the Gaming Galaxy, and today I'll show you how to unlock all the endings in Bravely Default 2. If you don't want to have any spoilers, just click off the video now. First off, there are a total of three endings to Bravely Default 2. You can't just do all of them at once or choose which one to do, you have to go through each ending one by one. So the first ending of the game is easily done by completing the story and going through the first set of credits. The game will ask you to save your file, and you should do it. Once the credits are done, you reload the save file, and new cutscenes show up. After this happens, instead of going to face the boss again, walk down and continue the story as the game tells you to. The second ending will have you go to the fairy village where you face off with another final boss. The same set of credits will rerun again, and the game will ask you to save as well. Reload this save file, and this is where obtaining the true ending can get a little bit difficult. The game does not explicitly tell you how to start the true ending, so I will tell you. Throughout the story, you obtain various jobs, but there are actually a total of three jobs you can obtain outside the main story. The first two are obtainable before this point, but the last one is only unlockable after finishing the second ending. The Gambler, Salve Maker, and the Brave Bearer are the three jobs that you need to unlock the true ending. The Gambler is the first optional job of the game that you can collect, and it becomes available to unlock after the first chapter. You start the side quest by going to the gaming hall in Savalon. You talk to this character here, and you do the quest from start to finish. You have to learn how to do an interesting card game with multiple opponents, however, but when it is time to do the card game with the final boss of the side quest, remember to save, because it will be game over if you lose. The Salve Maker is the second optional job in the game that you can collect. You can start this mission rather easily after starting Chapter 3. You go to this house in Inderno to start the quest, and unlike the Gambler side quest, Unlocking the Salve Maker job is as simple as completing a normal quest. The last job, Brave Bear, is unlocked by completing the second ending. You go to the area where Sir Sloan died in the prologue and you visit his gravesite. If you don't remember, this was in the area connecting Halcyonia and Savalon. After visiting the gravesite and a few cutscenes later, you are tossed into a difficult boss battle with Sir Sloan's ghost. Only after defeating him may you finally unlock the last optional job. Once all three jobs are collected, a few new cutscenes happen where you need to destroy a page in a magic book. This can be done by overwriting the purple save slot on the save menu. To continue the true ending, you have to go back to Halcyonia to meet with an old woman that you met in the prologue. And after this, the true ending finally starts. Well, that's how you unlock all three endings in Bravely Default 2. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you all next time.